happening, everybody? Michael finds out that the safety car driver was Dom DeLuise here! Hey, Dom. Oh, God! I don't believe... Shut the f*** up! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Who do you think are you talking to? You backstabbing hoe! You were watching your tongue, or I'll get to my Uncle Knuckles to beat you up with a garbage can! You were driving the safety car that tried to clean me out at Baku! These allegations! Where's your f***ing proof? This picture! My only question, how is he driving his car, the Alpini, and the safety car at the same time? What's happening, everybody? I am Mike Gumroots, and welcome back to F122, my team, Formula NASCAR career. This isn't a NASCAR video, completely. It's Formula NASCAR, but it's not a NASCAR video, but it's my first time recording since I got back from the Daytones. Can you tell the tan that I have now? I look a lot different than I did a week ago. I got this at the Daytones for NASCAR. 75th anniversary. I'm not gonna tell you how much I paid for it. Too much for plastic. I'm gonna attempt to wear this thing around my neck the entire video. I don't know if it'll last though because it's really kind of heavy. Last time out we raced Baku where we had another tremendous run but we just didn't have enough to claim the victory. First win of the season. We haven't seen it yet. Another second place finish. But we finished second place to Queen Latifi. I don't know how I could possibly live with myself knowing that I'm the first loser in Queen Latifi's first maiden victory. I'm the one guy that couldn't do anything to stop it. Look at these results. We've been so close, but just can't get the good great. What the fuck did I just hear? I swear to God. It, okay, it might have been my chair. I thought I heard a demon. Great runs, but not a single one of them is a victory. I'm looking to change that today. With that win, Queen Latifi bumps up from last. Zero points last. All the way up to 13th. He won the race, and he had the fastest lap. It was such a good weekend for Queen Latifi, in fact, that now he finds himself ahead of our teammate, Curious George. It's coming to the point. We're going to have to re-sign him mid-season. I'm not so sure if we will. I might look to find somebody else that could fill that ride and actually put up some good, good runs. I thought I was doing the right thing, giving Curious George a whole boatload of money. I thought he was going to do great for us. Not so much so far. So now that Queen Latifi has scored, everybody in the field has scored, and Dom DeLuise, that son of a bitch, is last in point. Ha! With three. Ha, ha, ha! That was three ha's for three points. Now even with Curious George not contributing a ton, we're still leading the way in the constructor standings. Moves Motorsport up by 12 over Ferrari and McLaren, up by 16 over Mercedes, 33 over Red Bulls, and... I don't Haas. No, we don't gotta mention Haas, because they're a long ways out. Take a look at our RD work. We started allowing the employees to have sex with each other again, and look at what happens. They're not focused, they're not concentrating, and the parts fail. So we gotta get the tertiary wing flaps. It sounds disgusting back in the works. But hey, we got front wing end plates. I do have enough resource points to get another thing in the going, so let's get another thing in the going. Rear downforce? That doesn't really do a lot for me. That does a lot more for me. Halo! If we can actually complete all these upgrades, look at how that's going to help us out comparing to everybody else's aero departments. Now, I know we're going to have to pay for a driver's contract, whether it's Curious George or somebody else, soon. So I don't really know if I should be spending my money. You know what? We'll do the four million quality control powertrain. That's not using all of our money. We still got a little bit of the bank, and we got some time to recoup some of this loss. Sponsorship renewal. Renew. Reaction trading for Curious George, like that'll actually make a difference. Kanata Nada, another one of the good, good tracks when it comes to the Formula NASCAR mod. We have raced here a ton with this mod, and we've always had very good results. It's always been a very good race. I can't necessarily say that the results have always been there. Let's hope today, though, they will be, and that we can actually get our first win of season two of our My Team. Let's get the video started. Let's go! All right, let's kick it. So 500 likes on the video, that means that one out of every half a person that watches this is gonna have to like this damn thing. I don't know if that's mathematically possible, but let's try 500 likes. And each and every person that likes will get one of these sent to their mailbox from 
Brian France because he's trying to get back in the good graces of the fans he wants back into the family business and he's willing to send you this bling blow to you welcome back him into the arms of NASCAR. Do you want Brian France back in NASCAR? Like this video. What does that have to do with Formula One, you ask? Not a goddamn thing! Look at that awesome necklace! Please and thank you! It's time to take a look at our starting grid for today's race. A fantastic effort from Charles Leclerc yesterday, and it's put him on pole. And Max Verstappen lines up alongside. Moving on to the rest of the grid, we have Perez, Sainz, Valtteri Bottas, and Hamilton. Norris, Ricardo, Ocon, and Alessio Delada. Russell, Albon, Mick Schumacher, and Magnussen. Oscar Piastri, Sonoda, Sebastian Vettel, and Lance Stroll. Sparkle, Joe, Woo! Latifi, and Pierre Gasly picks up the final grid slot. It's almost time for the lights to go out, so let's head down to the track where preparations are underway. Not last, because I cut some quarters mightily. It feels like I've got a pumpkin hanging from my neck. I hope that doesn't distract me today. Let's run this race! Hope to the big baby Jesus that this big old necklace doesn't get hooked on someone's front wing. I'm gonna go for a ride. We're underway at the Canadian GP. Queen Latifi, how you doing? Have you found a good spot to put your trophy yet? I'm looking for Dom Dewey! Driver of the safety car? And he thinks he gonna do me like that? Stuff me into the fence last week? That was dangerous! No, we have had a tremendous season two to this point. Been running real well, been up in the front and off. Why yellow? It, was, it like went yellow as soon as I popped vegetable. It's still yellow. Why? What's going on? Something's going on in the back. I think there's a red car that's broken. That better not be curious. Woo! It's Eclair. All right, we're going to gain on our points lead today. I thought that might have been curious. George that thought they cleaned up Eclair very fast. Damn, there. Wow! Curious George, where are you going? That's gotta be a penalty. You know, if I would've done some crap like that, that would've been a penalty. So as long as I end up in the top 10, and no, there could be other guys that end up gaining on and Claire and put themselves in second. We stand a good chance to gain on our points lead today, but it's not confirmed. He didn't even make it a full lap. He didn't even make it through lap one. Ferrari got reliability issues. I see Curious Joe, holy shit. All right, I'm gonna need a new diaper. Why am I so, okay. Did that happen? It was happening in qualifying as well. The car is extremely loose getting on the throttle. Like more so than usual. It's like I'm missing some sort of driving assist, but I haven't adjusted anything. Oh, damn. It's scary, man. You set it off into that first quarter. You gotta be making sure that the brakes actually work. Otherwise, you're gonna be categorized as an airplane. What the hell is this McLaren? Party, we I crashed the party. Oh my god, oh my god. Well, Vegetable just didn't want to give us any room. Four wide, four wide. There's been an look behind us, there's another four wide. Are we look we're looking at four wide again? I told you, Kanata Nada does not disappoint. Where am I gonna go? I mean, just where do you go in a situation like that? Yellow flags, a plenty today. And we are shuffling through some, oh my God! Drivers, I saw the little mermaid was popping into the top five. Botox on a medium tire. So probably gonna look to stretch it further than the rest of us. How might that strategy come into play? There's no chance of rain, though it looks like it could rain, but there isn't gonna be any rain. It's gonna get sunny by the end of the race. So it's not like that would, you know, benefit him in any way, staying out longer than going over to an intermediate or something like that. I don't really think it's gonna matter much at all. I think Botox just wanted to be different today. What the f I have no idea who just got me. Can we find out, please? Because I'm 
where, like, where did, I don't even know where the fuck that red balls came from. Sergio Perez over here wants to play around. All right, I can play. I can sneak up on your back bumper and spin you aimlessly when you least expect it. Hey, now, what's going on here? King Louie's getting away, guys. We can't do so much battling where we can't even battle for the win. We're gonna have to do something about this. I'm gonna have to try to push Chuck Norris up to King Louie and get things, you know, back together here a little. Especially because this isn't a typical track for a lot of safety cars. Baku last week, yeah, for sure. Monaco, for sure. Can -na 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 -na. No, not at all. It is just not a track where you're gonna get a safety car. There's nowhere for a car to get stopped where they would need to throw one. Plenty of places to pull off and get the hell out of the way. Unless I were to spin Chuck Norris around or something like through here. Then maybe we'll get one. Otherwise, I don't see it happening. Well, we made it. We made up all the ground. I, I just wanted to let you know. At least I thought we did. Now what the hell? They went and left me. They left me on this straightaway. How can I be so stupid and let that happen? We're going to be... Okay, yep, come on. Come here. There we go. Okay. Now we're back. Now we're battling for the lead again. We got to pit this time. Again, just stating a fact, just letting you guys know what's going on. Carlos Sings is also on this medium strategy. So they're gonna be able to stay out a bit longer. I'm just wondering if that's gonna like allow them to make up any sort of ground on us, the lead that Chuck Norris, King Louie and I have right now over everybody else. Will the different tire strategies close that gap? Oh shit, I gotta pit this time. I forget. Okay, I was speeding. I was speeding. Give me my ticket. I'll pay it when the chits is over. Just don't make me come back down pit road. We didn't have any problems for once. That's been kind of annoying to deal with this season. How often they can't get the freaking tires on. But we're good. And we're good for the rest of the race. We're down and away. King Louie is up my ass. Sniff it. It doesn't sniff good. Does it sniff good? Does it smell good? I can't talk! That's basically me asking him if his nose works. Does it sniff good? Do you got a good sniffer on you? Or do you have troubles smelling things? King Louie, I'm concerned about you. Whoa! Uh-oh. Yeah, I went that with too much heat on that tamale. Goddamn, that was a ghost chili pepper. There was way too much sauce on that. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. I got hardly anywhere to go. King Louie actually bailed out of it and allowed us to live. That son of a bitch. That gassy, gas and better take some Pepto. He hooked me. And now King Louie's getting away. If I don't find someone to help me with that, then I'm never gonna get to him. And I'm gonna need to find it soon. I know, because now he's just building up a lead. Like, yeah, I was able to do it with Chuck Norris and bump draft up to the guy, but there's only so much you can make up with the laps remaining. We got guys staying out for quite a while. That was definitely, yeah, I deserve that warning. So six of the top eight have not stopped yet. I don't think, we just had a yellow. Not sure what that was about. So when will they? Oh, Chuck Norris is up there too. Okay, so five of the top eight have not stopped yet. This is what I was talking about. With them being on the medium tire to start the race, how is that gonna impact things? That is such a friggin' wad right up ahead. It might honestly be a bad thing for them. Because, wow! I think that was a bad thing for all those guys to stay out that long, because Chuck Norris and, ooh, and King Louie and, and myself, they both, we all three, what? All of us gained a lot on them by them staying out as long as they did. We were all able to draft up to them. Dom DeLuise is in fifth, that son of a bitch! He was leading. He was at, oh my God, he was leading. I saw that blue dot way out in front of everybody else. I don't know how he pulled it off, but he did somehow. And now he's got fresh tires and he's running us down because we're all battling. And what the fuck is Albino doing here? Guys. Guys, this is this is a terrible idea. <laughs> Going off in there, three wide like that. Yep, Dom Deluise is freaking coming. Oh no! Yeah! Okay, yeah, he's here. Fifth place has arrived, and he's gonna be battling 
with us for this win. He's got the freshest tires. Goodbye. Oh, no, no. I was going to take that lead. I got hooked on his damn wheel. This is some kind of battle. Now we got five of us that are going to be duking it out for the top spot for this win in the final six and a half laps. Do not believe that the rest, ooh, that the rest of the pack can get to us. I think they're too far behind, but hey, you never know. If we like have an accident or something, one of us gets spawned in front of everybody else, then they'll be here. Dom DeLuise, how did you do that? How did you drive the safety car and your LPD at the same time? Yesterday's history! Tomorrow's a mystery! Fuck you! Well, that was one way to go about that saying, Dom. He's in second friggin' place. Didn't he? Yeah, he worked his way up to the front another time. There he goes to the lead. Holy shit. There is another Grand Prix, another race where he was battling up front. And then did he... What I saw, who the, who the hell was that? Was that King Louie that sent it off in there? He was battling for the win and then like the car blew up. Well, it happened again, I wouldn't. Mind it. All right, Chuck okay, Norris. So the gaps in the car behind is 12. No, I blew out my freaking voice. My voice hurts a lot right now. I don't know from what, what I was yelling about. But Chuck Norris, you're gonna friggin' get some! The smartest friggin' thing I could do at the moment is to lay back and to let someone get up to me so I could do some bump drafting. Magneto, my best friend of season two. Yes, let's get, or, or Curious George. I mean, one or the other. Okay, we're monitoring somewhere on the internal combustion. Great, so my engine's gonna blow up. Not Dom DeLuise's, he's driving off with it. Oh my god, he's driving away! All right, Curious George, I need you, or Ricky Ricardo, whoever wants to help. I need to slow down, let them get up to me, so I can bump draft and try to run some people back down. Finally, Curious George Yellow having flag. himself a run. Yellow flag. I guess probably because everybody got stacked. No, someone's blown up. Uh, oh, Botox is done. Botox is out of the sesh. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We gotta drive on up there. We got a lot of ground to make up. Finally, Curious George is having himself a run. Let's go up there and displace the guy out of the lead that used to drive your car. Oh, not goddamn Ricky Ricardo. I don't need you getting in the mix. That just slows us down when we got another guy trying to hop into our bump drafted yellow flag. Oh, it's still Botox. They haven't cleaned him up yet. Come on, come on, come on. We are actually getting mighty damn close to this next group. We're actually not too far off, but we made up a ton of ground that lap. And now we've lost Ricky Ricardo. Wow, we might still be able to win this damn thing. I remember now. There's someone else blowing up. Don't wreck him. Well, at least there was a yellow for a second. I don't know what that was about. In our last Canadian Grand Prix, Dom DeLuise was driving for us, and he had an awesome run here. He's just gifted at the Kanata na 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 We got always going for What the fuck? I lost control over the car. I was going so fucking fast. I can't turn. Well, Curious George, Enjoy the podium. Are we gonna get a safety car for that? They're stopped. They are all stuck. How did... <laughs> that was so ridiculous. Why did they all get... I'm looking at the goddamn... I'm telling you, it's so loose. What's yellow up ahead? What is going on? We didn't get a safety car because it's so late. Otherwise, we would have had one. And now, Curious George is up to second spot. Right after the intro of this video where I was talking mad shit about it. While Curious George is battling Chuck Norris, Ricky Ricardo for second, third, and fourth, there's another guy that has completely checked the fuck out. Dom DeLuise, winner. Winner of a lot of races lately in our NASCAR Rivals series, is coming down to take the white flag for his maiden victory in Formula NASCAR. I, uh, like, there's still a lap left. You know what? I'm not gonna say anything yet. He still has a lap where he can fuck it, and knowing Dom DeLuise, he can fuck it hard. 
So I'm not gonna say nothing until he crosses that line and his name comes across the top. Let me get this straight. This piece of crap damn near kills me at Baku with his safety car drive. And now he comes here and somehow wins the race. He's a ridiculous man. Race, I don't know what this does to the Michael Moves universe of videos. How now Dom DeLuise being an F1 winner affects things and all of our intros and all the nonsensical storylines that I come up with. But Dom DeLuise is an F1 winner! I don't know how I feel about that. I feel disgusted. I feel absolutely nauseated. My stomach is gurgling with nauseousness. Because he tried to kill me last Canada. week with a safety car! He hasn't even gotten out yet. He can't believe this to be true. He what got out. He climbed out. Dom DeLuise. We'll Alessio Dom DeLuise De Lada is an, an F1 winner. At the same the time, he's a NASCAR Cup winner in our NASCAR enough. Rival we'll Series. It was great to watch as well, wasn't it? Forget How strategy, could anyone miss out on the talent that this man possesses? Dom DeLuise is a winner! Let me say that again. Dom DeLuise! is a winner. I don't even know how the hell to feel about that. I don't know how I feel. I can't put any words out that'll make any sort of coherent sense. Free a pizzas for everyone! Except a you, a boobza! Wow. Okay. No free pizza for me. After all that I've done for you! Eat a this! Wow! Real classy, Dom! Dom is your winner. Curious George. After we, so I, apparently all I gotta do is talk crap about these guys. I talk crap about him being in third with, no, not being in third, having only three points to his name. He wins, I talk crap about Curious George not doing anything, I might get fired. He ends up with a second place run. I just gotta talk some shit and they do well. I think it's really just to make me look stupid. Chuck Norris in third, Ricky Ricardo, myself, I have no voice left. That race took it all out of me. Albino in sixth after whatever the hell I did to him down in the hairpin. Gassy, Sergio Perez, Hill, and King Louie, and Yukio takes the last point. We got Magneto, Mickey Mouse, Acorn, Sings, Stroll in the Park, Vegetable, Little Mermaid, Queen Latifi, Joe Mama, Oscar Mayer Wieners, Botox, and Claire. Two DNFs right here, and Claire didn't even complete a lap. It was the pole sitter too, wow. So here's what happened with Albino. Oh my God, I just went storming in there with Curious George, Albino, King Lou. <laughs> and now he's pinned against the wall. King Louie won't let him go. So eventually he gets unstuck and then everybody else follows. King Louie finally gets going. <laughs> Little Mermaid, how the hell did the Little Mermaid, why are you backing up? Did he just drive right? Right into the... Okay. Okay. Uh, and he drove into the wall. That was so unnecessary. I hope you retire at the end of this. You don't got it anymore. What the hell are you doing? How did you... Is this... Wait, who is this? That's Joe Mama. Driving away and then just ducks it into the wall. That should have been a safety car. It was just too late in the going. Still can't win one of these damn things, but I guess it's another consistent run. And we extend our points lead up to 30 now over Chuck Norris. We're gonna be with a clinch early if we keep this run up. Even with the win, Dom DeLuise, you don't even see him on the first page. What a bum! No, he's back on the first page. Curious George, up to 11. Let's find out where our friend, oh, he's sitting in for Okay, so he was only one spot beneath there. Dom DeLuise now has 28 points. Good for him. Is this now what we're dealing with? Where we're just gonna have the underdogs when it, week after week after week, we had Queen Latifi last time. Now we got Dom DeLuise. Next, we're gonna be Stroll the Park. Week after that, Joe Mama. Week after that, the Little Mermaid, no, the Little Mermaid ain't winning nothing. You saw him drive into the wall like that. We extend our lead in the Constructors because of Curious George's heroics, up by 14, now over McLaren. Was that actually, did we extend it? I don't, I don't remember what it was before that race, but hell of a lead now. 41 over Ferrari, 43 over Mercedes, I did the math, 58 over Red Bulls. Next week we should get the tertiary wing flaps as long as everybody remains focused at their jobs. I think I'm gonna be saving money for a little bit now. We're not gonna go ahead and buy any more facility upgrades. It'll just be R&D work. I think, that's, I think that's about it. I'm taking this thing off of my neck because it is heavy. British Grand Prix is next up. 
Can it fit over my headset? Yes, it can. So remember, if you want one of these beauties by way of Brian France, he's shipping them out tomorrow from what I hear. Like the video. If we could get it to 500 likes, that's the only way that he'll be shipping them out to all you guys that like, but it has to be 500. He told me, he, he called me up on the phone. He's like, Michael, it's gotta be 500 likes in order for them to get the necklace in. I was like, Brian, you feel it all right? Yeah, man. I don't know what the fuck I'm getting on about. I'm getting out of here. Thank you guys for watching. Love eh, every single last one of you. And we still haven't won a Formula NASCAR race. It's been a long time since we pulled that off. Maybe next week. See you in the next video, everybody. Goodbye!